Who's back from New York? I went to New York for Easter weekend to see my brother. Me and my sister went. Literally, we got there Friday and came back yesterday. The main question is, what did you get for me? So, Mecca said that he wanted a basketball jer- jersey because he has one. He wanted another one. I looked and looked and looked. But I just didn't come across one that was his size. The ones I saw were like medium and he needed double XL. So I tried. And I told him to get me an Easter egg and I came back and he gave me that, you know, that, um, oh, um, yeah, it was out of stock. And, Could you try again? I looked at multiple stores for you. You didn't see. I even told you. But you, you see, you ordered one, <laughs> tried one time and then was out of stock. So hey. I wanted, I wanted a, a dairy-free Easter egg. The subway is very, very cheap compared to here in the UK, I believe. Because you, you know how here we have to tap in and out? Mm-hmm. You have to tap in one time and it's like $2. Okay. But then I was like, I guess you keep on tapping in, it, it can rank up, I guess. But I, I wasn't using the subway that many times. And the bus, if you pretend like a thing isn't working, or sometimes you just walk in. Remember, remember I said sometimes the bus team is free because you just walk in, they don't care. <laughs> well, because you're 6'6 six, six and they're scared. Okay! <laughs> That's racist, six, six, six foot six black man. But to be, New York was actually like, I was telling Mecca that, because I knew a lot of like um, the, the banks and stuff like that, their, is it headquarters? H- yeah, the HQ. Yeah, the HQs are in New York. So if you want to, if you want to do a little one month, two month stint in New York, only I'll come. Only one month, that would be like two years. Okay, I don't want, I don't want to go. One of the best decisions I've made, probably in the last year, was joining that gym and getting a car. <laughs> uh, feels good to drive to a gym that has all the equipment you need. I can just train hard. My tendonitis is still flaring up, so it's healing. I'm still training my chest well, still looking good. Currently making my post-workout meal, and then I'm gonna head to the office, so really busy day. As you can tell, my day is filled with gym, work, and yeah, that's mostly it. Don't be under the illusion that if you work in banking, you're making quite a good amount of money, you're gonna be, you know, enjoying life. Probably at your desk most of the day. Anyways, catch you guys later. Back home, but far from done from working. It's currently 7.30. I'm gonna log in in like 20 minutes and then work probably till 11 p.m. or 10 p.m. and yeah, it is what it is. Let me quickly show you guys what I picked up while I was in m and So if you're not aware, Clarence Court make really good eggs, but there are different types of Clarence Court eggs. They're quite pricey, but I got the Burford Browns, which I've tried before. And then I got the Leghorn Whites, which I've never tried. So I'm excited to try that. And I also got this one, the blue one. So let me show that again. Also got the blue one. They're quite pricey, but having used these eggs and used normal eggs from Tesco, Waitrose, there's a big difference in taste, the quality, and I eat eggs, I eat around seven eggs each day. So take it from me, I know my eggs, and these are definitely, and these are definitely worth the money, in my opinion. Um, so yeah, gonna try this tomorrow for breakfast and lunch. I'll let you guys know what on how they taste. Morning, morning. Hope you all are doing well. Time is currently 5.10 and I need to leave for the gym by 5.40. So every day now, I go to the gym at 5.40 because it opens at 6. So I more or less need like 15 to 20 minutes to get there. So between 5 and 5.40, I actually prep my food now because I'm using an air fryer to do it. So I'm just make the food now. So that way once I come back, I can shower and then head to work. Plus it means I have more time to actually work out, which is what I enjoy. So it just makes sense. And it just goes to show when you change something in your routine or you want to adapt your routine to your current situation, you should and you can. It's just about making it work. It's just about knowing what you want to prioritize. Right now I'm deep in a cut, I'm dieting down. I really want to prioritize my training performance and also I joined a new gym. To make that work, I still wake up at five, 
But now between 5 and 5.40, I just prep the food instead of going to the gym earlier on. So. <laughs> So right now, he's currently rushing, trying to get all his cooking for work done. Um, he's supposed to be out of here in 20 minutes. <laughs> Let's see if he makes it out in time. <laughs> but as for usual, he's always kind of running a little bit late, but that's, I guess, the sacrifice he makes to get his workouts in. Um, he's currently seasoning, but it's so interesting how he seasons his food, but it always tastes a little interesting. I don't think he's mastered the the chemistry of um, seasoning your food. I tried to like give him tips, but he never pays attention. So his food always ends up tasting a little, but he tries. Ameka got me some protein powder. What's good people, back home. Also got a haircut, as you can tell. I finally look kind of human again, so. Loads of work to get done tonight. Today's Friday. I'm gonna shower, have dinner, and then look back in. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for legs. See ya.